another video. This is Motivation for Young Christians. Welcome back, welcome back. Welcome back to another episode of Bible Study. Today we're going to be diving into John chapter 20, verse 30 through 31. We're going to be talking about the purpose of the book. To begin, we're going to start off with a prayer by me. We're going to be led by me today and then end off with a prayer by me. If you guys can, please bow your heads and close your eyes. Heavenly Father, we thank you, we praise you, we worship you, God. We thank you for this day that you've made. I rejoice in again, God. I pray that now is about to get into this time we're going to be discussing your word, God. We pray that you'll be able to help us understand this word, God. We pray that you'll be able to speak through me today, God, to be able to deliver your word and have this conversation onto the people, God. We pray that we're going to continue to be in your Bible, God, be in your work, and just continue to strive, continue to learn, God, and to be able to sharpen the iron, God. We love you and we thank you, God, in Jesus and your holy Amen. For today, guys, we're getting into John chapter 20, verse 30 to 31. Verse 30 says, The disciples saw Jesus do many other miraculous signs, in addition to the ones recorded in this book. Verse 31. But these are written so that you may continue to believe that Jesus is the Messiah, the Son of God, and that by believing in him, you will have life by the power of his name. Now we're going to begin into my notes. Not all of Jesus' signs were recorded in the book, because in the Bible, but the Bible was written to continue to tell the story of Jesus and to have us believe that Jesus is the Messiah, the Son of God. By believing in him, we have power in Jesus' name. So not every sign was written into the book, but enough of the so that we're able to believe and the bible is our tool is our guide our instruction and the way to live the way that we serve god the way that we do things right the bible is a very instructional and important thing in life you can't be a christian without being in the bible without having a bible because you're going to be misguided misled you're just going to be going down a path with no guidance on it but thank God we have the Bible because the Bible is there to educate us, to guide us, to put us in the right direction, to teach us what's right, what's wrong, and just continue to educate ourselves. And we have the Holy Spirit who continue to be with us. We have God that continue to be with us. So our journey will have backup. We know the journey of being a Christian, it, it won't be an easy journey. You will have to endure child tribulation, pain, hurt, things like that. But it's going to be worth it at the end because you'll be able to make it into the glory kingdom of heaven. And on this journey, we're not alone. We have Jesus, we have the Holy Spirit, and we have God himself that's continuing to guide us. And he said he'll never leave us nor forsake us according to his word. So we continue to have him on a daily basis. Never forget that, guys. Uh, now we're going to be going into the end of prayer for today. Heavenly Father, we thank you, we praise you, we worship you, God. We pray as today as we read the purpose of your book, God. We pray that your people will continue to be in your book, God. Continue to be in your book to learn about you, to learn about miraculous signs that was performed by Jesus, to learn why Jesus did this, to learn why Jesus did that, just to continue to learn by your word, God. This is our instruction, our guidance, and God, we need it in order to live, God. We pray that we're going to continue to dig deep into your word, God, to be able to understand scripture, to be able to bring our thoughts together, to educate each other for I to continue to sharpen iron, God. We pray that you continue to be with each and everybody, God. We pray in this upcoming week, your God, and protect them, God. We pray that no one can form against us, our Father, God. I pray for health and strength, God. I pray for well too, Father, God. In Jesus, in your holy name, amen. This is the end of the video, guys. Thank you guys so much for coming back to another episode of Bible Study. Thank you so much. If you haven't already, like, subscribe if you're new, turn your post notification. And this is Motivation for Young Christian. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.